Hey everyone, welcome back to the Pokemon Casino. It's been a while, apologies, it's been super busy, but we've got another video this week and we are cracking open VMAX Climax as I continue to go on my approach to try to get a master set of this. There's still a lot of cards we need, so let's get that cracking. Before we do that, remember to hit like and hit subscribe because we've also got this little gem over here as well. And what is this? It's a new playmat, basically, for our openings. Pretty excited about it. Let's see which one it is. Can you guess? It is direct from the Pokemon Center, Japan. And you hear, you see them right on, right on. Amazing mat. Let's get this cracked open for this opening. There we go. The full playmat is here. You see, you've got spot for your bench cards that you will want your bench pokemon your trash as well over here your deck goes up here battle playing field and of course your prize cards go on the left side so let's get on with this let's get these boxes cracked open and see what magic we're going to be pulling all right here we go we got 20 packs two boxes and hopefully a lot of magic here. So let's shuffle them up so we don't know which pack is from which so that we are pleasantly surprised when we pull a secret because the next secret could come from anywhere. But as you know from VMAX Climax, it's not only secrets that matter, we got also a lot of CSRs. So those character secret rares. I think the card that I would want most actually is the Friends of Galar one. I think that's a secret rare card. So hopefully that one's gonna be in the plan today in one of these packs uh i'm missing that one for the master set slowly building it up keeping a lot of the hollows and like the reverse hollows as well but man this feels good to crack open some packs haven't done it in so long i feel oh i forgot it has these really nice uh energy cards as well but let's see what magic is here Slowly, ooh, do we have a trainer card? And Acerilla's Premonition actually is a great one to get as well. Here's our hollow. And, oh, we got a Zamazenta. So we got a Zama, uh, Zacian, I mean, Zacian over here. And a double energy reversed hollow or a dotted hollow or rainbow hollow pattern over there. So nothing over there, just some regular cards. I guess you could call a Zacian V a regular card because, uh, there's CSRs and there's CHRs that we'd want from here. Another energy card, uh, like a metal energy card. So steel energy. So let's see what we're going to be getting. Got a fighting energy. We got, ooh, we got a, we got something here. We got a V. What the heck is going on? <laughs> we got two Zacian Vs in a row. Uh, and of course this could be also from like different packs and just mixed it up so it happened to be like that, right? So that's weird, but here we go. We got fire Hopefully that means we're gonna get friends of Galar over here Is it gonna be another Aslarella's premonition fire? What do we got? Oh, we got Umbreon. We got Umbreon V as well So that's nice and these these hollows are definitely gonna be keeping them and sorting them out because you need all of these for the master set if you want all of them so we got that one over there, there's gonna be 20 of those, I guess. There's one in each pack, from what I recall. It's actually been a while, I feel, since I did my last one. So, uh, last opening of VMAX Climax. Hopefully you guys are all doing well. We have a very exciting video coming out next week because we have Triple B, the next set in J Japanese coming. And what do we got here? Oh, we got a Pikachu VMAX. Sweet. I think we already have this one, but uh, you can never go wrong with a Pikachu, right? Pikachu is always a nice one to have. Um, probably just to sell that off to another collector. Get some funds back as we continue on our master set challenge for Medax Climax, which is a massive set. There are 184 cards in this original set, in the main set deck list. Got a Zekrom, very nice over there. What do we got over here? Oh, Pikachu, very nice. So a Pikachu V. We just had a Pikachu VMAX. That's sweet. But we haven't got any of our CSRs yet or CHRs. So hopefully that's going to be coming up. Excited to see which ones we got. I've been picking up a few of those, sniping them off from 
some dealers over here so I can get a set if there's a good price on them. Just in anticipation of that master set. Oh, we got Orbital VMAX over here. So it seems like we are saving up all the magic for later on in this opening, which is not bad either. So like I said, Triple Beats coming out next week. We're gonna be doing giveaways as well for that video. So make sure you are subscribed if you're not already. Uh, so you're eligible to participate and you know when the next video comes up. We got, oh, here we go. Oh, sweet, Houndoom. I don't think I had this Houndoom CHR. This is really nice, this is 206184. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't have this one yet. So that's nice. This is definitely going towards the master set that we're building up here. And I actually really just like the colors of this uh, playmat actually. It's really, it's really nice, it really stands out. So I feel like for opening videos, it's, it's uh, quite a nice mat to have as a background across all the other pretty, pretty cards that we are gonna be pulling as well. So let's continue going on, let's just Cheryl. Is there a full art for in this one or the one before, I forget. Ooh, we got, ooh, Shadow Rider Calyrex VMAX. Hey, we got a CHR again as well. Not bad, we got two back-to-backs. Like I said, we are saving these ones. I'm not sure if this is the one I already have though. Uh, but you know what? Always nice to have, and if not, I'm sure someone else that's also looking to collect all of the CHR, CSRs. I don't know if VMAX Climax is ever gonna be reprinted. I have a feeling it will not be. So I think it's just going to mean that more people will probably want to get their hands on this if they're trying to build that master set. I know I'm a bit late. This is a 2021 deck. Ooh, Galarian. Oh, okay, Rock Rough. Hey, another CHR. So what, what's it going to be a CSR? I'm very curious about that. There should be one in each box, I think. Either that or you get a Secret Rare, an SR card, which I believe is Friends of Galar. So hopefully that's the one we're going to be getting because I think it's actually gone up quite a bit in price as well. It's, it's such a great looking card. It goes really well with the VMAX Climax ones. Oh, we got Jolteon over here. So we've been hitting up the CHR bandwagon over here so far. And so hopefully we're gonna be getting some even cooler ones in the future. Of course, we no longer have CHRs, CSRs in modern sets in Scarlet and Violet. We got the ARs and the SARs, which to be honest, are very pretty as well, and they look spectacular. I cannot wait to crack open a bunch of those packs when we, they come out next week. Oh, look at this level ball. This has a nice hollow pattern on this one, the synth score. So, continue on. Yeah, so we're gonna get some really nice ones like the Magic Carp that I had posted on my page. Super pretty looking card. And so, hopefully we get some of these Magic ones. I can't wait to see what like this, uh, uh, SARs look like and what the, what the heck? Oh my god, is this is this? Oh, I thought it was the more Peko one. I mean, it, of course it is more Peko. I, I thought it was the Marnie one. Uh, so I already have this one, this this V Union, and I'm waiting for uh, or not waiting for. I wanted the one with Marnie in it. Uh, that's the S uh, C S R version of it, not the C H R. This. Uh, the one with Morpeko, just Morpeko without Marnie, is the regular CHR version of it. So that was exciting, but hopefully it will come up so that we don't have to pick it up. I don't see it on sale too often. So hopefully we're gonna get that. Oh, this is, oh, that is a great one to get. That is a great CSR. Mimikyu VMAX, this is probably one of the best ones you can get with the CSRs. Oh, look at that. Such a nice one. And of course, you got Gardevoir in the back and another CHR. So we got double hits here, double whammies. What a great looking one. I actually just might keep this one because it is my double if it looks good. This does look like a great one. I think this is worth grading actually. Oh, there is a print line across there. Uh, but that's still, still what a great looking card. And I wish I had sleeves. I don't know where they are. I should have sleeves with me, but they are not here, but I'm just gonna put this on this new playmat. And as it is a new playmat, it's very clean. So that's scary. Let's put that in the background. Really nice pull, I thought. We got some more heat going on. Let's see what else we're gonna be pulling, guys. This is this exciting. This is, are we gonna get a Galar friend? Oh no, we got a judge. Oh no. Oh, what? Well, we got a Mimikyu VMAX as well. And we got a Charizard. <laughs> Okay, uh, not a, that that is crazy. That's just all from one pack. How is that even possible? It was like three hits. 
So we got Judge, which is unfortunate, because uh, it's Judge, and I don't think anyone else cares about Judge. But we got a Mimikyu V afterwards, and then we got this, of course, Charizard, and you cannot this Charizard or not like it. So really nice ones over there. So we got our CHR and SR, and it's always a chance to pull another SR, I think, because that's like a not a highly sought after one. So I think they really give you a chance to sort of double up on your secret cards and get another one uh, within the set. Oh, there we go. What did I say? We got it. Oh my goodness. This, this box is stacked. This box is absolutely stacked. So we got another secret rare card just after pulling one. We have a Zamazenta V as well. And then we got our CHR, which I think I already have, but holy smokes. Two double hit packs back to back. Like, that is crazy. That is really great luck. This is, I, I miss opening packs, guys. I just been so busy, just haven't had time to. But here we go. We're trying to get back on the rhythm uh, and do this Pokemon Casino lock. And look at that great looking VMAX. This is this Rapid Strike uh, Urshifu. So nice. Just look at those colors and how they pop off of it, right? These V, I love VMAX cards and how they look. Super nice. Uh, can't be disappointed with that one. I'm not sure if you even have it, so it could go towards the master set. But here we go. We'll continue on this Pokemon journey. Let's see what else we're going to be pulling from this set. Oh, there we go. Is there a Zora V? Uh, CSR. This is crazy. We got two CSRs. We've got two SR cards as well. And like a load of CHRs. And now I remember why this is one of the best sets that you can get. So good. Like this is why V-Star Universe was so much fun to open as well. Check out those videos if you haven't already. But this is such a great opening. And we got another VMAX card over here. Sent to Scorch as well. Look at that. Look at those colors pop guys. Look how great that looks. This is fantastic. Oh man, I, this feels like I wanna keep ripping open packs open, but gotta be responsible. And uh, only do it when I have time to edit these videos as well, because I wanna share everything I open with you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. We got, ooh, I was wondering if that was gonna be a uh, CHR card again. But nope, we got Galarian Zapdos out here. And we got our last pack of this banger of an opening. This is absolutely crazy. What a great, what great two boxes. Uh, so happy with them. Uh, hopefully you guys found it shocking as much as I did. Okay, we got a Bolton V there and we got a Snob, but that's the uh, Reverse Hollows. That is great, but let's look at, see what we've got actually from this set. So if we're looking at the VMAXs and just the Vs, we've got some really great looking VMAXs. Just look how the great they look. I know EXs are nice as well and the Scarlet and Violet have come out now, but these ones are just amazing in terms of the texture they have, especially in Japanese cards when you feel them. It feels so good. Uh, they, just, they just hit differently, right? And then we get, end up with our Pika friend over here. And by the looks of it, it does have a print line. I think a lot of these had print line issues. Uh, and then we also have a Bolton. And let's see what else we got. We got this uh, four set as well. Unfortunately, it was not the Marnie one, uh, but hopefully we will get that soon. But here we go. We got a secret card, two secret cards, guys. Two secret cards from two boxes, which is you're finding like that's usually okay, right? That's what we ex expect. And then we got CHRs. And then we got a CSR uh, as well as Zerazora V. And then we got more CHRs. And of course we got Charizard, because everyone loves Charizard, especially Pokemon Company, because they're printing out the new classic set. And then we got this amazing CSR, probably one of the best ones, of Mimikyu. So nice, and then we wrap it off with other CHRs over here. So we got two SRs, two C SRs as well, and then a bunch of CHRs, like, like three per box, like six over there. Hopefully you guys like this opening a lot. I really had fun, really surprised and shocked at how great our luck was at the Pokemon Casino. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already for more Poke content. We are opening up Triple Beat next week. Video should be up Thursday, uh, my time, so that's Asia. 
if you're opening up packs, hope you guys have fantastic RNG. Until the next one, bye-bye.